Welcome back to Awesome Possum Hobbies and Games. I'm Chris, and today we have an Amazon find. Um, I found these tokens on Amazon for Magic the Gathering. They're plus one, plus one counters and other buff negative modifier trait tokens. Let's open it up, check them out, see if they're worthwhile or if they're just garbage. Let's go. These are the metal buff counters. Here are the, the trait tokens. Let's go ahead and open them up, see what the, the quality is and see if they're any good. Uh, right now, the, the, the price for these on Amazon for 40 is, these are $13.99 and the 36 with the traits is $14.99. So for both, you can get both sets for under $30. These are considered black though, they are a silver type metal. Let's go ahead and open it up. It, it does come with a bag, but I recommend getting one of these cheap plastic boxes from Walmart. I got this one from Timu for holding uh, deck uh, cards, um, uh, a deck of standard playing cards. Here are the bronze style ones. I'm sure they're they're both made of the same type of metal. On one side, you get plus one plus one. Let's see, see there, plus one plus one. The other side is a negative one, negative one counter. Uh, you get 40 of them, so 20 of each style. So 20 of the bronze, 20 of the, uh, I'm betting that these are just pewter. Uh, so it, they're, they're, they're a pretty good size. Let's go ahead and compare them to the size of a magic card. You know, if you put them on a magic card, it's a great size. Compared to a dice, it's about the same size as a standard size dice. Compared to a, um, U.S. quarter, you know, slightly smaller than a quarter. The size is supposed to be 10 millimeters high, 20 millimeters uh, across, and two millimeters thick. So it's about the same thickness as a standard U.S. quarter, and is you know just the same, about the same width. So it's a pretty good size. Let's compare it to a spin down. So if people want to question the size, here's the size comparison. For overall, for $13.99, for 40 counters, these are, are not bad. I like the finish of them. These are, are not bad at all. Uh, let's go ahead and open up the other box. Let's see what the trade counters are all about. It's coming in a black velvet bag, much heavier. Probably because of the size. Let's go ahead and check them out. These have different colors. Of course, the finish. I like the finish of the, the patina. That's the actual technical term for when you have some kind of coloring on the inside. And these counters are, well, here's indestructible on one side. The other side's death touch, indestructible, trample, haste, flying, Uh, hex proof. There's trample and uh, other side of that bronze or the copper color is menace. This one is first strike and vigilance for the gold. First strike, vigilance. Um, silver is reach and lifelink. That's all of them. So, gives you a nice little variety. Of course, missing is double strike. You might be able to pick those up under a different brand, but these are kind of a generic brand, which I actually like these better than the Citadel, which is the more expensive ones. Uh, they, these cost a little bit less and you get about 20% more. And overall, I'm pretty thrilled with the quality and they are identical size to the plus one plus one counters. So you, when you stack them on a card, that's what they would look like. You know, give it flying or hex proof, plus one plus one. Or if it was minus one, minus one, you just flip it over. Of course, you don't really need these. You can get these smaller counters somewhere else, but I like the, the metal ones, especially for when it comes to the, the traits. You can always use dice instead for the plus one plus one or minus one minus one. 
transform them like that so you have you don't have to use all of them or if you move them around because you have uh, tracks in play or something else that proliferates it might be not a bad way to put you know use a dice next to it uh, you know you do whatever you you feel is best but you know overall not bad i actually like these counters not a bad price and if you like them too, check out the affiliate link I have in the description below. Um, we get a small little kickback from Amazon if someone goes through and purchases them. Um, I, I actually recommend these. I'm going to play with them. I, one, of my, uh, one of my players in my play group bought these and said I should check them out. So here they are. I'm a, a big fan. I'm glad I bought them. I can't wait to use them the next time I play a, a Traxa deck or another plus one plus one counter deck. And they fit really well in these little plastic boxes. So, if you uh, have any questions, please list them in the comments below. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic week, and keep them rolling. And thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please take the time to like the video and subscribe if you'd like to stay updated. Have a great day, and keep them rolling.